Ah, uh, here we go, and it's the first Sunday of the month. Once again, this is the Antique and Collectible Auction. We've got some wonderful things set out here. You will not believe the cool things. Plus, we've got a lot of the things coming from the huge collector house. Um, we'll show you some of the stuff right This is all sterling in here. Look at the beautiful candelabra candles, uh, vases, all sorts of cool stuff back through here. Got some antique tools, some antique books. And check out this guy. I know we got two really cool bicycles, but check out this fighter plane. Isn't he cool? Um, nice jewelry, nice estate jewelry coming in. Got a beautiful diamond ring right here, which is 1.6 carats in the center stone. Has a 12,000 $500 appraisal that was done back in 2002. Uh, beautiful gold watch, two gold watches. Check out that man's enamel watch. We will have, we're working on catalogs right now. You can hear Emily and Robert in the background trying to get that together. Got a little gold coin necklace, little diamond necklace. Got some blue topaz there. Um, some neat sterling jewelry bound here. So, like always, you never know what you're going to find. It's always a great adventure here at Dudley's Auctions. Now, we do have some real estate coming up. We've got some on-site auctions coming up. We've got some specially targeted auctions. We have one that's all folk art dolls and one that's going to be all miniature firearms. This is all Orfers, um, Danish, Swedish. These are all like Waterford pattern pieces. They're going to be sold in groups. Wonderful crystal. Just coming through here, you're going to see some Toby Jugs, World Dalton Toby Jugs, some nice pieces through here. And check out these pipes, man, they're very cool. Came out of the collector house, she traveled all over the world, and you just never know what she's going to bring. These are French clay pipes. Cloisonne, lots of wonderful cloisonne, chapelave, some really nice oriental pieces that I'll be showing you more of as we go. Look at those cloisonne plates, they are just so cool. Um, those are the Goble Monks. I'm going to get right on up here. Um, have some Wedgwood, some cool paper, more crystals, some just beautiful stuff. Wait till you see it. Um, military items here. Um, we've got his, this paperwork that goes with it and all the medals. Um, some Danish modern things here. I'm going to come back from that once I come back from doing these showcases. Check out G.I. Joe and his What's this, Robert? Is this somebody's model? G.I. Joe tank right there. G.I. Joe tank. 1970s. Wow, how cool is that? The airplane models coming through there. Now there is, this whole row up here is all Tiffany and company. Wonderful porcelain, jardiniers. Check these out. These are amazing. Hand painted, gorgeous. Look at the artwork and detail on these bird plates. Um, Tiffany, Tiffany, and Baccarat. Some more art glass through here. Look at these. I want to put it around and show you. Look at the birds in the nest. Just beautiful. Got two sets of those. Some wonderful crystal. Those even come with chocolate. Another two sets of crystal here. Just some wonderful things. Now here's our pottery pieces. Got some, there you go. Jardiniers, Roseville, McCoy, English. This is Clary's Cliff right here. Really interesting piece there. And there's some hull. And lots of sets. Two and two and two. McCoy English pottery here. This is all the Bristol glass. Check this out. There's two sets there. Here's some vintage pottery. Deco. These, believe it or not, came from two different people, but they're all the same pattern. Some were decorated and not. There's some more breast, bristol sets. There's some other groupings. Just some really cool, nifty stuff. Now, keep in mind, we have an on-site coming up in Floral City. Actually, it's in Inverness on the way to Floral City. Um, do you got any on-sites, Robert, coming in? Nothing yet. Nothing yet, but there's, you never know from one day to the next what's going to happen. So this is our little mid-century section. Got some wonderful art. Check this guy out. Some great watercolors. Just a really nice selection of pieces all the way through. Look at the burl work on this wardrobe. I think we have three wardrobes at this sale. This is the mid-century modern here. Now, when we did the last mid-century modern, it was gone, went crazy. That one actually has made in Denmark. By Selig, S-E-L-I-G, -E -I, -E I think it says. Anyway, 
coming back through here. Some great, look at this guy. Clock. Some wonderful mud men. Those are actually bottles with the alcohol inside. This guy, look how great. Look at the face on this one. Talk about character. There's some really neat pieces through here. Coming in this way, more oriental. Food dogs. Satsuma vases. Nice collection of enamel pot and then the animal pot of um, rolling pins. Got some glass rolling pins here. Check out these pieces of kitchenware. Oh no, look. There's some art through here. I really love that sailboat one up there. Nice watercolors. Nice, nice watercolors. A lot of enamelware here, but look at this stove. White Star. There's a little motor there. Uh, there's a Frosty, a Crosley, no, a Crosley refrigerator. These are in really great shape, too. If you want to set up a vintage kitchen, man, here you go. There's the original Frigidaire. Some more. There's some Thomas Kincaid pieces up through here. Some more kitchen. Nice little Martha Washington sewing cabinet. I'm going to slide around here. Got a nice table and chairs, the velvet seats, mahogany. It's got the carved legs. Really cute. Got some. Come on, that's all right. I don't go with it. <laughs> a couple of really. One, two, three, four quilts. I see a double wedding ring in there. Look at this platform rocker. Very cool. Very cool. Nice oak piece there with the dresser with the towel bar on behind there. Nice ivy set of dishes. Big, huge collections of collections. That's part of the deal that came from this collector house. So they'll be selling lots of groups together. Um, like the milk glass, like the depression. We've got some other groups that are sitting in the back. Teacups and saucers. Just really cool. Nice drop leaf table. Eight of the rows back carved. Here's another drop. Here's another swing mirror. East Lake. Through here. Ooh, look at all the ladies. Ah, uh, check out these. Cookie jars. Now these are great cookie jars. One, two, three, four, five of them. And look, there's a pair. Thou shall not steal. And there's a, the butcher and his wife. Or the baker and his wife. Very cool. Oyster plates. Coming back this way. Grandfather clock. Check this. Bicycle out. Very nice. It's a special. Got the original basket. Makes its own little bells and whistles. Very cool. Got some La Crusette. Um, nice roll top desk. Art glass. There's a, a phonograph. A pump organ. Just really cool. Lots of tray locks. So there's a really lot. Real nice collection of different things. Lots of wonderful china. Crystal, have yourself a tea party and come get all your teacups here. Barbie dolls. These are really, really nice, guys. Nice sets. Oh, look at all this carved woodwork. Man, oh man. I'm going to spin around. Hold on. We're going to go for a spin. Seats are set up. There we go. Remy. There we go. We got look at this. This is a lift top. Ethan Allen set. Isn't this nice? And check out these. These are wonderful. The work on them. Now, when you go look at these Hitchcock pieces, you will see that they are really nice. There's a set of one, two, three, four, five, six. Every one of them has a different scene in the front. They all have the description in the back. They're all signed and numbered, so that's really cool. Oops, and there's some artwork. Check out this bird. These are all carved stone. You want to talk about these guys? We're really just working hard trying to get these things. I can't even tell you what this represents. Maybe it's mother with twins. Could be. There's a dolphin. She sits up. She probably three foot high. Wonderful little pair of table, a chair, some table. There's some fire screens, needle points. Look at this armoire. Isn't she beautiful? All inlaid wood. This one's got inlaid burled wood plus the carved panels in it. Really nice. Some like some federal mirrors. Drop front secretary. More cloisonne. Corner chairs. Come around here. Beautiful. Another East. Uh, this dining room set that has the sideboard and the china cabinet. 
more of the Mun Men. Very cool. Check out these guys. Man, look at the work. Aren't they wonderful? I love these. Oops. Is a sign and number Maryland. The facial Monroe. expressions are just amazing. Just amazing. Can you imagine and doing all that work? There's another really cool tall painted piece. A little telephone table. We're going to spin around. Look at all the jadeite. Rennie, could you do me a favor? Oh. Look at all the copper. This comes from the collector house, too. Lots of really cool pieces of copper, guys. I think he's going to do them choice five times the money. Can you turn on the light, Rennie? And Geo Rose. Okay. I'm going to talk a little bit about some of the things we can go, and I'm going to come back and do it with the lights on. Okay, guys? Look at this cool travel, these two travel cases. They're vintage cases. they got the glass top on the place. Talk about a cool coffee table, something you don't see every day. Let me go get these. See, look at all the collections. Oh, my gosh. And I love these. I'll come back to them here in just a minute. But these are all those vintage planters. Aren't they cool little animal planters? And we've got so many of them, like this pewter. We're going to be selling them in groups and piles. Hold on. I'm going to walk around so that we can go turn on the lights so I can get you a better view of it. And we'll talk about some of the sales that are coming out. We do have a house that's just right down the road from the auction hall. The lady was a big collector. Again, a lot of stuff in her house. We're going to be auctioning that off coming up. Um, we have a specialty auction that's on the 19th. One of it's going to be done in two separate, two separate sales. One of them will be the folk art. If you go to the website, you can check it out and see. Um, they'll be doing that one first, and then the mini guns will be done after that. And then we have an on-site auction on the 26th where we're selling the real estate and the contents. Um, there's a house, there's a boat, there's a truck, there's all kinds of stuff. So go to the website, check it out, you'll see all the cool stuff. I'm going to go back through here and show you some of the things. Look at all this wonderful hand-painted china. All right, look at these great salt glaze pieces. Wonderful, aren't they cool? Biscuit jars, some big ticket biscuit jars there. Some nice collections. This is an original Chinese fishing net. Can you see it? Here, come around the other side. Oh, how cool is that? You can hang that up almost anywhere. It'd be great for decorations. Um, some neat repop pictures. A lot of the pewter. Those are cool. I'm going to slide these. Got some oh, wartime coinage. There's an early rocker, and uh, there's a high chair, and some quilts, wall pockets. Shoes, Dutch shoes, more of your planters. These are the bird planters. Look at all the cows, ducks, chickens, all those little creamers. Some more of the pink planters coming through there. Everything from Shawnee to American um, USA pieces. Very cool. And there's a bunch of the puppy dogs and the ducks. I mean, these are highly collectible. And when you get a chance to get all of them all at one time, how cool is that? Then we go back over here. Here we go. I don't know. I'm going to hold this up and you can look inside. Oh, milk glass. Oh, and those are all candy. Those are all candy containers. So they got some Native American stuff. Let's look at there. Some cool stuff. The opalescent china. Some quitters. There's some more Native American pottery. Look at this set. 1970s kitchen. How cool is that? Even got a little blender there. Sewing machine. Got the stove, the refrigerator, and the sideboard. These are all wonderful needle points back up through here. And this, I'll check out all of this dinner, all of this cookware. Let's see if I can find. Very cool, huh? There's a collection of sifters, collection of cookware, collection of clocks, collection of... Look at this nice native. This is a beautiful native piece. There's some prints. Check out this piece. I love that one. Awesome, oh, cool. Native prints, sleepy eye flower, some advertising pieces, again some really nice native. Here's the Kachina dolls. Let's see if we can get him to come out. Some more Native Americans, some carpets. Some carpets back through here. Other pieces. And look at the faces. Those are all leather and with real fur. 
There we go. And then this is a one, two, three, four piece with a bed, full size bed, oak bedroom set. Great for a boy or country kind of feel. A little pop up potty chair. Um, the rod iron set is really cool. All hand painted, a lot of painted stuff through here. Check out that one. Now coming down, look at all this copper. And some of this is absolutely amazing copper. A lot of it's made in Italy. They got some great weight to them. Some of it's hand hammered. Just a really nice selection of copper and brass in which we're going to be selling. Check those out. Back to the jadeite. And then here I'm going to show you this. Go all the way around. I think he's going to do high bit of choice off of here. How cool is that? Look at all those fountains. Nice lampshade. Oh, and check out this. The old oak bucket. So go ahead and check it out. Call me if you have any questions. We've got lots of stuff happening here at Dudley's Auctions. We'll look forward to seeing you at 1 o'clock. And back on the first of the week, we're back to our regular schedule every Tuesday morning at 8, every Thursday at 5. Specialty auctions and on-sites are listed on the website. Make sure you go to it, check it out. And uh, welcome to the new year. Welcome 2018. We'll see you on Sunday.